Hi, I'm Cindy Hodnett, Editor-in-Chief of Designers Today. We're here in Greensboro at Hughes Metalwork. I'm with Howard Bemis, a.k.a. Steve Irwin. Good day! You ladies look absolutely gorgeous! And we are going to take a look at what Howard does to take scrap metal and turn it into beautiful, beautiful works of custom art. So, Howard, tell me, how in the world did this all get started? This kind of all evolved when my boss and friend Brian James, who you just met, came out. He brought a picture of a bottle tree. It was about seven years ago. And he asked the shop to make this tree. And it was very straight, no curves. Everything was just very rigid. We made it. He asked me, being the tree guy and studying the art of bonsai, he said, what, did you, what do you think? And I, I said, well, it's kind of straight. He kind of said, well, what would you do? And, Immediately when that happened, the light bulb went off and all these years of art, photography, and bonsai, thinking I was never going to be able to make a living at this stuff, all kind of came full circle. And I knew immediately what I was supposed to do. So I, I learned and picked up a welder. I kind of taught myself how to weld. Uh, it was my mistakes as a welder that kind of helped me see what I wanted to do. It helped me see the bark, see the texture. I was really bad at the beginning, but it, it helped me kind of envision where I was going with my new technique, which is kind of different. It's, it's not normal welding, I'm telling you that. I kind of use a welder as a paintbrush, so I'm just thrilled to have found what I was supposed to do. Well, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna take a look at some of the creations that you've made. Um, but I'm curious, just tell which one's your favorite one. Most of the time, the last one is my favorite one because that's the freshest, and that's the one I just finished. But there are certain trees that I've made that definitely tell a story about my life, what I've been through, what I want to go through. I mean, I would say certainly Intimate Embrace is one of my favorites. It seems to be very popular and. I think it's found a new home, which I'm really excited about. But you know, just that rust tree the other day, I had never done that. And I just, you wake up one morning and you go, I think I'm gonna try something new. And I, I weathered the tree and people are, are loving the look of the rust. Very good, very good. Well, as you can see, there is definitely an art that's created here in this Greensboro Metal Workshop. If you would like more information, go to Designers Today and we'll have um, Howard's information there and he can talk with you about creating a special project for you. Till next time, thanks.